classification of bacteria depending on the morphology. They are classified into cocci, spherical shaped organisms. There are five cocci which give rise to infection in man. First is cephalococci. So gram positive cocci range in clusters, then streptococci, it's a gram positive cocci range in chain, uh, pneumococci, it's a gram positive cocci, it has got, uh, it's a lanceolate shaped and two cocci enclosed in a single capsule, it's called pneumococci because it infects the lung, and then meningococci, Half moon shaped, two cocci enclosed in a most of some of the strains are capsulated, then gonococci, kidney shaped, concave and facing each other. So, this is the uh, cocci. The rod shaped organisms are classified depending on three criteria. One is acid fast bacilli. Example M tuberculosis and M leprae. Then gram positive. Lactobacilli. Conibacterium, Erisiflothrix, Gram positive or Lactobacilli, corn Lactobacilli, Cornibacterium, Erisiflothrix. These are some gram positive uh, and Listeria. The second criteria that the spore formers, one which forms in the presence of oxygen, that is anthrax, one which forms in the absence of oxygen, that is clostridium. So, next is gram negative bacilli. Gram negative bacilli are entric organism mostly, salmonella. Shigella, Proteus, Pseudomonas, E. coli, Klebsiella. Then there is a spiral shaped organism, Spirella minus, which guys tries to ride by Philip fever. Then spirochetes, they are uh, leptospira, leptospira, borrelia, and triponema. Then cell organism, mycoplasma, mycoplasma, and uh, higher branching bacteria, actinomycetes. There are uh, cocobacilli, they are, remember mnemonic BBHY, Bordetella, Brucella, Bordetella, Brucella, Hemophilus, Here, senior. So, please remember the classification of bacteria depending on the morphology. A bacteria are broadly classified into cocci, spherical shaped organisms, bacilli, rod shaped organisms, 
comma shaped organism is vibrio cholerae 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 so once again i'll repeat cocci are important five cocci one is cephalococci is a gram positive cocci arranged in clusters gram positive cocci arranged in clusters gram positive cocci arranged in clusters why they are arranged in clusters because divided in all planes daughter cells fail to separate out from other cells they are arranged in clusters streptococci is gram positive cocci arranged in chain streptococci is gram positive cocci arranged in chain pneumococci lancet shaped two cocci enclosed single capsule meningococci half moon shaped two cocci enclosed some of them are capsulated freshly isolated and gonococci is uh, kidney shaped concave uh, it gives rise to gonorrhea now uh, the rod shaped organism three criteria spore forming capacity For example a spore bearer is anthrax and clostridium clostridium further divided into welchi botulinum and tetany welchi gives rise to gas gangrene tetany tetanus and botulinum gas gangrene uh, gram positive organism lactobacilli dental caries erysipelothrix meningitis lactobacilli dental caries erysipelothrix rosopathio skin exanthemata listeria monocytogens that is meningitis and uh, gram negative e coli klebsiella salmonella shigella proteus pseudomonas vibrio cholerae is a comma shaped organism so gram negative uh there is a organism spiral shaped which is rigid spirulomonas rat bite fever then spiral shaped organism which is flexible there are three species leptospira tuponema borrelia leptospira gives rise to bacterial jaundice tuponema pallidum causative organism of syphilis and uh, leptospira jaundice tuponema pallidum syphilis borrelia recurrentis that is that gives rise to relapsing fever then there is a uh, higher branching bacteria that is actinomycetes and there is a cell wall like organism that is called mycoplasma so this is in nutshell the basic classification of uh, classification of bacteria basic classification of bacteria please remember the important uh, organisms you can write it down very neatly if you want i'll write it down neatly once again the classification of bacteria so this is in a rough uh, you can uh, write it down and is it so i'll write it down neatly staph strep nemo and gono staph septo nemo gono meningo bacilli bacilli anthrax Clostridium, MTB, M. leprae, Listeria, Corynebacteria, Erysipelothrix.
then the E. coli Klebsiella Salmonella Shigella Proteus Pseudomonas Cholera bacilli Mycoplasma Mycoplasma is cell wall less organism. Embryo cholera is comma shaped organism. This is cell wall less organism. Then Cocobacilli, Borrelia, sorry, Bordetella, Brucella, Hemophilus, Yersinia. The nectanomycetes, nocardia, then spirulum minus, spirulum shaped organism, spirulum minus, then rigid body, triponema, triponema, borrelia, leptospira. So you should remember all these organisms in systematic bacteriology we deal chapter wise. Thank you very much.